Hello everybody, Roy Oshrove here and I want to talk to you how I configure Total Commander. Now, why do I use it? That's a long story. But if, you, if, if you're using Total Commander, first of all I applaud you, second of all you get a free a license to Linux and I don't know. Um, anyway, I go to configuration options and in the layout I like to actually show the button bar. If I have people next to me, uh, I want them to to see what are the functions, it makes things feel a bit less uh, scary for them. I like to show two drive buttons on the top here. Um, <clears throat> in terms of display, I of course show hidden system files because I'm a power user, yo! Um, um, also, I sort directories not just by name but also by time. So if you'll notice in my columns I always sort by date. Because I usually that's where I need to go. The late uh, and um, is the places where I've just been and the things that I've just played with. Um, um, now you can actually configure color. For example, I might uh, define colors by file type. So I can actually say, well, all exe files are in the color blue. So you can see here it's colored blue. I can change it to, let's say, green, darker green so that they feel a bit more like you can run them um, <clears throat> so it's a really good way to filter out things that you really need to do in terms of tab stops a lot of people like to have tab stops right under here the extension column uh, I like them right after the filing um, so that's just my personal preference size display this is very important I want to see here you see at the top exactly uh, how much I have left but not in bytes so I always have size display set to dynamic with XY including the giga uh, so that's very important otherwise things look very very unreadable to me um, nothing on folder tabs that I do custom columns nothing uh, I don't use the custom languages in terms of operation there are some really cool things you can do that I like to do of course I use left mouse button uh, on terms of selection mode um, the default is to use the right mouse button, like uh, Norton Commander, uh, but I wasn't a big Norton Commander fan. I am a big Total Commander fan, so for me this works really nicely. Um, when I select stuff, I also want to select directories, not just files. That's very important when you work with a lot of files. Um, when I edit and view stuff, sometimes, and this is not my development machine, but a lot of times in the viewer and editor I will use like notepad plus plus and something like that so that when I press F3 or F4 I still get the same editor <clears throat> no matter what and I just configure the editor that when I press escape it closes copy and delete usually I would turn off standard copy method and this is a really big thing if you do a lot of copying between stuff I also check this also use big file copy mode when you're copying things locally, it actually increases the speed in which file copy is being done. Uh, and it's usually pretty safe. You can tell it to turn off on specific drives, etc. Uh, but I usually just use this and I find that copying is much, much faster. In terms of refreshing, uh, if you have a specific drive um, that you would need to, that takes a long time to refresh, like a network drive, you can turn that off here like it automatically refreshes every time you switch to the Total Commander window. Um, now quick search is something I really like to do. Uh, if I'm in a window I like to just type and the, the file to be found. So I, I like to have quick search just by typing letters and automatically get a search dialog. I don't want to have to press a shortcut to find something because usually I just want to find something. A lot of people use Total Commander and when they type they just want to type stuff here at the bottom. Uh, so automatically that happens. But for me I just like to search for stuff and then run it. So I remove beginning or ending and so it also looks for stuff that is contained in the file name. So if for example I'm here I might say just find all the no close and it automatically you see the search window here and automatically finds the file. Okay, back to options. Uh, we were here in operation, view, copy, uh, quick search. Um, nothing in FTP and plugins that I uh, do too much. Uh, let's see if I remember anything else. Uh, nope, that's basically it.
So not a lot to do, but still it makes a big difference when I use it. So maybe if there is more demand from the crowd, um, I'll do some more stuff about cool things you can do with Total Commander, etc., etc., etc. So uh, have a good evening or morning or wherever you are. Obviously, you're seeing this on YouTube, so it could be years from now. Um, tell my future me something, but funny. Okay, cheers.